you all well. Today I'm going to be doing this party look for you. I think this is really good for the festive season, really good for New Year's Eve, for Christmas and any time of the year when you want to go like all out for a party. So I thought I would do like this really nice eye. Um, it's got a little bit of shimmer in but not too much glitter if you're not really into glitter like wow that is really glittery. Um, it's a really I think this is a really nice look and this lip is so perfect for the festive season. So if you like this look then please keep watching. So firstly I'm using the Carly Bible palette and I'm using this shade here on an E40 fluffy brush. And I'm just going to pop that in the crease and the upper crease area and do what we always do, pop it in and then go backwards and forwards in circular motions to blend it. This is a really lovely colour. Now, using the shade here from the Carly palette, I'm using a E25 brush from Sigma, and I'm just popping that through the crease. And doing the same, going backwards and forwards in, wind, in windshield wiper motions. And flicking out at the corner. So we look more satty. Then once you've got that, I then just blend again, just to make sure it's all seam seamless and there's no harsh lines. Such a beautiful, those colours together look so pretty. Again from the Carly palette, I'm going to be using the darkest shade here, this like nice plum on the same E25 brush from Sigma. And to deepen that crease, I'm going to run it through the crease. Looking up at the outer corner and just running it right through the crease. And I'm going to grab that first shade we used on the E40 brush and I'm just going to blend that all together once more. Probably not once more, <laughs> probably a few times more, but again. <laughs> I'll probably deepen that crease a little bit more in a little while. For the base of the lid, I'm going to use this MAC Dazzle Shadow. Um, it's a beautiful kind of uh, black blue with kind of like some purple, pink and blue iridescent um, flecks in it. It's really pretty. I don't like glittery, but um, if you don't want to go really, really glittery, this is a perfect option. And this is in the shade Feel the Fever. And I'm just going to pop that all over the base of the lid with a MAC 242 brush. And this complements the um, crease colour really well because of those nice pink flecks, these, those purpley pink flecks that are in it. They really tie in really well together. I've got to kind of look over my mirror for this because it's got those glittery bits in. Ends up all over my face otherwise, so hopefully you can still see... And if my dogs didn't bark all the time, it would be so much more easy to film. I think my mum's coming home, so they're really excited. Right, I'm going to go back in with that dark plummy shade in the Carly palette. And I'm just going to run that through the create... Why am I talking a million miles per hour? I've got like hardly any time to film, so I'm like, ah. Okay, so I'm gonna run the plum shade from the Carly Bible palette through the crease once more. The darkest shade. Do some more blending with the E40. I've got a little bit of that on the lid I'm gonna pop a little bit more of that MAC Dazzle shadow just on the lid again because I've lost some of the shimmeriness Ta -da. for the brow bone I'm gonna grab this matte cream shade and it's really quite pigmented so you don't need too much I'll blend that in a second. 
And then for the inner corner of the eye, I'm going to go with this shade here. On the lower lash line, I'm going to be using this shade and then I'm going to pop a bit of the darkest shade on again. So this shade first and then this shade using the pencil brush. To create a wing and to bring eyeliner down into the inner corner of the eye, I'm going to use the Maybelline Gel Liner. So I'm just going to put some false eyelashes on. I'm going to use the Carly Lash from Velour Lashes. I thought I'd stay with the Carly theme. Um, but I'm just going to put them on, then I'm going to put the eyeliner in the inner corner of my eye. So I'll be back in a sec. Now I'm just going to put black eyeliner in my waterline. And I'm just going to use Roller Lash Mascara from Benefit. Blend my eyelashes a little bit, but I always get a bit worried about doing this. So I'm going to pull my eyelashes off. So I'm only putting a little bit on. I've had them tinted, so hopefully you can't see my own lash eyelashes too much. And um, then I'll do my bottom lashes. For lips, I'm using Too Faced Melted, and this is Melted Berry. So that's the final look guys, I really hope you enjoyed this tutorial, I really like this eye look um, and I hope you did too, so please subscribe if you would like to see more from me and I'll speak to you soon.